Hello, hello, welcome back. So, here we are, continue on. Let's see, which way we go? Alright. We're probably getting close to the end. I don't like the looks of this. I doubt they're here to help. Subjects on site. It's time. Initiate the Tvia field test. Sir. Huh. That's how that's pronounced. Of that mass effect in here, isn't it? Aren't you all on the same team? Team. Fool. There are no teams in Deep Ground. Deep Ground? The place where my brother and I like to play. Cool. Now, mind moving aside. Interesting, we only seen Weiss and Nero. Uh, the the uh, Deep Ground and Dirt of Cerberus That's had, I think, five people. I can't blame a girl for trying. So either they got right count out or not part of deep ground just yet. Have you read? Okay. You immune to uh, everything, apparently. Stay at range against this guy. This will blow your mind. Okay, phase two. Wait, he was in a straight jacket the entire time? I just kind of noticed. It's definitely not 
definitely want to stay at range against this guy. Is he blocking our damage? Halfway almost. Pressured. It's okay, it's magic attacks doing it, isn't it? Why does he keep canceling the lock on on him? I'm not even pressing the button. Just a pop it too. So uh that's a thing. <laughs> he could he could uh pop his attack while you're doing a limit break. That's a thing. 
Doesn't look like it did damage to her though, because, you know, limit break immunity. Again, seriously, I just revived him. We gotta do a, an incredibly annoying three-phase battle. This better be the last boss, that's all I'm gonna say. This better be the last one. Cause that shit wasn't funny with the, uh, you know, you know, Rufus and all that. I'll tell you right now, that was not funny. <laughs> Can't, the controller isn't responding. Hold on. Reconnect and see if it helps. This is a weird glitch. Like, you see the pop up. Uh. Okay, so I get the mouse and keyboard respond. Okay, that, I've not seen that happen before. That has not happened before. But that was unusual. Wait, what? Oh, is some points were lower to begin with? What? Oh, that would explain a lot, wouldn't it? <laughs> alright, alright, let's pick that before we go in. Let me see how we're supposed to stagger this guy. Alright, give me a second to look up how we're supposed to stagger. Okay, did it. Oh, uh, it, so it is used ranged and then jutsu at first, okay. Huh. But he's supposed to go to close range if he gets, starts getting pressured. Wow, we were almost on the last phase of that too, that's, that's depressing.
There, look at that. That's what's throwing up a stagger. Okay, he gets pressured switch. I really wish we could skip these little mini, you know, cutscenes here. You know, when you fail a battle multiple times, it gets grading very fast. Trouble my sense just to skip go past the next fight.
yourself. Why does it keep resetting? I wanted to stay in you know range mode. It keeps randomly resetting. It's annoying as hell. Getting that art award is what I should be using. Great, chain stunning. Can't see enough of that in this game. Anytime now you want to get pressured, it'd help. Anytime now, boss. Okay, now we're in Fort Faithful. Oh, he's got his mask off.
There we go. It's not okay. He was not that annoying. It's just I didn't realize how you know, the hit points go were so low going in. That's probably why you know having to heal so much more than normal. Plus, not understanding you were supposed to save your limit breaks and remove it for the last phase. Wait, how did he get his mask back on? It blew up, didn't it? His model showed the mask off and then he got back on the cutscene. What? It makes no sense, even by this game's standards. Don't want to spoil the moment, but we should probably get going. But I'm so tired. I could carry you. You win. Sheesh. <laughs> oh, that's not good. No, he's not appearing in re rebirth. <laughs> Interesting that they have the, uh, well, I guess, do we just call her Teen Yuffie for that model, or, because Yuffie is still a teenager, I guess Young Yuffie, maybe that's the right, one, right term, way to describe her, but oh, damn. Oh, wait. Apparently, I've been misunderstanding this sequence the entire time. That wasn't Yuffie. It was apparently somebody else entirely. I probably should have been paying attention more.
And it feels worse seeing the, the, the uh, plate drop because we saw the, the uh, top side drop from, you know, Kate Sheets' uh, point of view, but only briefly because he got there too late. Now we actually see it dropping from Yuffie's point of view, and it's even worse than actually experiencing it. Ooh. Don't think I can do this alone. The amazing Yuffie wants you. Join her team, and the sky's the limit! Hey, Barrett? Were you really walking the whole way? Yep. <sighs> Calm's still pretty far, though, isn't it? Another full day, give or take. Question. When my mom says a full day, she means from the time you get up in the morning till the time you go to bed. But for me, it means from the time you get up in the morning all the way through till the time you get up the next morning. So, which is it for you? Gotta go with Elmira on that one. Good to know oh, Eris is on, uh, you know, is Men in Black called? time. <laughs> Cloud, bet you've had to hoof it from sun up to sundown tons of times. This is all just same old, same old, right? That's right. But even so, we're all gonna need to stop and rest. Especially you. Yeah, yeah, I know. Anyway, marching into the unknown ain't easy. But don't worry, because I'm here to lead the way. <laughs> That's comforting. Of course it is. <laughs> All right, everyone. Mm -hmm. Let's stop here for a minute. Leader's orders. Now breathe in that fresh air. Oh. Huh? Actually, scratch that. Let's, uh, save it for later, when we're not so close to Midgar. Guess this is goodbye, City of Mako. Like this? Yep, just like that. Cool. <laughs> you know, there's oh. something kind of, uh, no you way. know, funny about her being taught how to hitchhike. <laughs> and I can't believe that worked. <laughs> Ah! <laughs> 
That's Chocobo Bill. I was wondering why there was a cast credit for him when I didn't, we couldn't, didn't see him at all in the story yet. <laughs> they actually gave him a credit for one for, for a one line sentence. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Look at that. Where's a roof when you need one? Gonna be okay? That reminds me, they don't actually have rain in Midgard, do they? Weird. My stomach's in knots. That's its way of telling you it's hungry. Let's move! Or that you need Pepto Bismol. <laughs> Time no see. How you been? Listen. Hey. Uh, uh, I'm back. So, uh, major plot divergence here. He died in the original. Now we know for sure he's alive after what we saw in the ending sequence in the main game. Aerith? And if I'm correct, he's actually on the cover of Rebirth, which kind of spoils it for anybody who hadn't cleared it yet. Oh, an achievement for that. Wait, 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 hold on. Okay, so I was under the belief that he was a, he was a boss there either way. Because remember when we saw him earlier in the cuts in this D DLC, we talked about how he's part of the main, you know, the, he's a super boss in the main combat simulator. But you have to actually do integrate, you know, the interme inter intermission to, to unlock him? That doesn't seem right. Because he's supposed to be done after you've uh, done all the other ones. Like that's unusual, cause I guess it makes sense that we you know we can't actually fight him until he's actually in there in the story, because the intermission is you know part of this. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Let's save our clear game data here. Okay. Yeah. But yeah, all right. Yeah, okay. Yeah, let's take a look and see what that what, the, what it says. We had because uh, I was pretty sure you, in order to fight Weiss, you had to clear everything else first. So yeah, let's take a look at this and see what it says. For his fight. Should be everything. Well, 
way. How do we get back here? I'm the one who carried you here. <sighs> All right, we gotta me. do this sequence, don't My we? My mom and I stayed here. The room. Okay, we can't skip exactly it. Don't scare us like that, Are man. You okay? Maybe you should rest a little longer. Every morning, I remember crying here. All right, come on. Aerith. Ken, I would not understand why they forced the uh, walking anyway, at some point. Gotta get to the roof, right? Then we can use the same elevator that Hojo did. That elevator was it this way? Yes, his odor still lingers. I just want to, ex you know, examine the fight. Of course, you are welcome to or would you prefer the portable version? I look forward to receiving all of your future battle intel submissions. We've added a new oh, individual's this is a new cutscene simulator. I can't divulge any details, but I can say its existence is both highly classified and extremely dangerous. To be completely honest, I had some misgivings about implementing it. Even now, I'm still not entirely sure I made the right decision. However, I do believe that engaging it in combat will yield vital information. And who better to extract that information than you, Cloud? If you're willing to try, I'd appreciate the help. Sounds like an excuse to go unga bunga. <laughs> uh, was that red tint normal? I don't think I've ever seen that that before. <laughs> oh, so you can fight it. Okay, look at that. You can fight him anytime, but it has been hard. Okay, okay. See, I thought it was only after unlocking everything else. Maybe I'm thinking of something else that uh, actually does unlock. See, that okay. So he was not the, uh, the, the uh, trial for that. Interesting that the uh, you get the, the oh you get two of them. Huh. Hmm. Well, well, well. From my from, so from my understanding, these uh, got demorungs. Did I just say that right? And in one shot. <laughs> huh. So, but yeah, from uh, what you get. From my understanding of those, they, they give you a limit break from the start, and they constantly charge it throughout the fight. Which, uh, makes things a very interesting. So, I am going to have to do some research on that fight first, because it sounds like something we could actually do. And then go back and, you know, in preparation for hard mode. Which would be ironic if we, you know, clear him out first, huh? I imagine, you know, despite being, you know, the last fight, you know, rather the uh, super boss of this game, there's probably, some of the other ones are probably actually harder than him. It, I guess it depends on the perspective. Some of these are only available are okay. 
All right, so Weiss is unlocked. Oh, we're missing battle intel still? Uh, oh, right. Hmm. Shame Yuffies and Sonans don't carry over to that. I guess it'll make it look too easy, huh? Okay, so... I'll, I'll just save it here. There. So, what we're going to do is... I'm going to study up on the fight. And probably do that as a bonus thing. Before we go into hard mode. Because it feels like getting got, got to Dummerung before going in... Would actually be the right... Your right choice for hard mode. You know, and go and do all that. And you know me, if I could take a you know cheap option to make the defang something, I would do it. Like look what like look if you look back at our Mass Effect Insanity playthroughs, I use cheesy strats for that. And brut in StarCraft Brutal. You know, it, 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 you know, from StarCraft 2's Brutal, I learned one thing learned something from it while looking up guides and everything. It was a comment that someone said, I think it was a Reddit post. And it basically summed up the, you know everything that we should have been doing in those brutal runs that applies to here at hard mode runs. You know, it was paraphrased, it was like, you know, when playing on brutal, you only need to be clever once. And that's honestly, you know, a good, you know, a right thing, you know, it is the right idea. You only need to be clever once. You're not playing against humans, okay? Playing against actual AI. You only need to out with the AI once in order to complete your mission. And that's pretty much what you need, you need to do here. Cheese them. <laughs> it's not... You know, there's, no, there's no Ibushido here, okay? So, yeah. We're going to look at... You know, the Weiss fight. And see if we can score those got, a, uh, got Dumarungs before going on. Anyway. We'll see you next time. And thanks for watching. Uh, I uh, I believe I will do a hard mode playthrough of the main game. I, I can't see myself doing it for Yuffie's DLC. Just because, because some of that was a little bit annoying. But I may change my mind on that. For the time being, we'll, we'll, we'll come back. We'll be back soon with a different game as an interim thing while figuring out what our next big you know, series is. Otherwise, we are done with, um, you know, other, other than a uh, you know, hard, you know, hard mode playthrough and, you know, getting all these uh, uh, extra uh, fights we didn't get to do. We are done with 7 Remake for at least two and a half years in terms of the main story. Because it will be at least two and a half years, most likely, before it hits Steam. I don't have a PlayStation, so we, we are not going to be able to you know, play it on release or anything. But yeah, going by the reschedule of you know 7 Remake on the, on the PC. Granted, that was the Epic Games thing, so if they, unless they do that again, then it will, probably will be two and a half years. If not, then hey, great, we'll be able to get to it sooner. And it seems like Square's not, you know, realizing to, to stop ignoring the uh, PC market, or at least do it right. Anyway, we'll see you next time for our next game, and, and well, in the future, Weiss Battle and Hard Mode. So, thanks for watching. See you next time.